Oh, there's a fish. Woo. Oh, really? Um, we've got a little bit different technique set up today. Of course, we're going to be throwing the fly rod. We've got some umbrella rigs with some really small swim baits on them. So we'll just see what's working today. And uh, we'll catch back up with you in a minute here. Oh, there's a fish. Woo. Oh, really? Yeah. What's the Umbrella rig. Really? Yeah. Okay. Let's see here, guys. First fish of the day. Been out here probably 10 minutes. Uh, looks like a little striper, yeah. Sweet. No, that's a spot. That's a big spot. I'm gonna... Here. Can you net him for me? Woo! That's a decent fish. That's a decent fish. Hey! Woo first fish guys been on here 10 minutes i'm just throwing an a rig but what i've done is i've taken and just put some real small little shads on it um they're called oh, what are those things thin shads maybe nice little spot probably a pound pound and a half not too big but still a pretty fish just let this dude go Oh, there's a fish. Yeah. Uh, I don't think so. We'll see here. I've got another one in the bottom of the boat. Uh, I think it's another spot. Yes, yeah, it's just a... Nothing huge. Looks like he swiped one of the ones on the top. I'm just using owner uh, ultra point swim bait heads just because I need something light wire because I'm using some light baits. Santa came to see ho 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 with your nose so bright won't you got my sleigh tonight. Hey fish on daddy old. You think so? Hey little spot I don't have my finesse rod with me but what I've done is I've taken kind of an old rod we keep in the boat I put a 10 pound fluorocarbon leader and I'm just fishing a very small zoom super fluke on it I guess technically it's not a super fluke it's like a tiny fluke or whatever but we'll see if we can catch anything we're in real shallow water these uh, stripers and spots have fish run back up into coves this is the day's number one producer so far it this wind is Oh shoot. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, I was swinging it right under that dock. Like literally just cast it the side of that dock. Oh, that's a nicer fish. That looks like a largey there. <laughs> That's a nice fish, man. I was casting this dock right here. And what I did is I cast on the far side and let my thing sink so I could just put right under that dock. And he was just sitting on that outside corner waiting for bait to come by. Uh, large mouth tend to be a little bit more ambush predators than spots are. Spots will chase a little bit for you. And he has got this thing way in his mouth. There we go. He's got one of his eyes popping out on one side of his head. 
There he goes. Because bass seem to really like corners of docks. Oh, there's one. Yeah. That might be a better fish. No, nah, I can't tell. Man, the A-Rig is just... He's hooked somewhere in the... That's a pretty nice fish, too. Well, that was graceful. Pretty much what we're having to do right now is just one of us run the trolling motor um, just to keep the boat straight while the other one fishes. And I'm throwing a drop shot while I'm running the trolling motor. Um, and then Dad's on the umbrella rig rod right now. Yeah, that was a good cast. That's going to give you about the same angle that I caught that largemouth on. No. There he is. Dad's got one now. That's a nicer fish, isn't it? You need a net? This is in the bottom of the boat. That's pretty nice. That's a thick fish. Looks like a spot. That's a nice fish. Dad's on the board now. I got you, I got you. 